Hello and welcome back to the Kitagawa Europe Focus Channel. We're here today to talk about one of our latest four Thaxis products released from Kitagawa Japan, the MK series. I'm also lucky enough to be joined by Sophia, who's kindly popped in to ask a few questions about it. Hi Hamish, thanks Hi. so much for having me back. So I see we've got some rotary tables on display today. So these are the new standard from Kitagawa. Spot on, the MK series will essentially replace the MR as our go-to for Thaxis product. Great. But exactly why has Kitagawa released this new series of rotary tables? We've got an MR series um, at work and although it's old, it still does the job. So what's the reason for the upgrade? Kitagawa released this new series with three major improvements. These will complement the current and future vertical machining centres being released, which are going to be stronger and faster. Wait, stronger and faster? Hamish, don't you mean better and faster? Actually, in this case, it really is stronger and faster. The first area we've improved is the static clamping torque. In the past, it was uh, common to use hydraulics to achieve a high clamping torque. Oh, I don't like hydraulics. So messy and, at the end of the day, expensive. I'm happy to say now, for some time, Kitagawa has only had pneumatic clamping on their fourth axis rotary table of up to 320 millimeter faceplate size. That is good news. I much prefer working with pneumatics. I agree with you, and most modern machine tools come with built-in pneumatic systems already. And the great thing about the MK series is we've almost doubled the static clamping torque over its predecessor, the MR series. This is achieved using a patented multi-disc clamping system, so the MK200 can achieve a clamping torque of 570 newton meters compared to 350 newton meters for the comparable MR200. So it sounds as if rigidity and clamp torque are the key features with these MK rotary tables. Yes, we recently released a video demonstrating the rigidity of the clamping torque. This was done by drilling a 30 millimeter hole into a 60 millimeter wide steel block with 5,500 newtons of thrust force. The MK200 didn't even flinch or move at all. I've seen rotary table setups with trunnions and so on that make a standard three axis um, VMC. Very efficient and versatile. Yeah, a well-designed setup can vastly improve your production output as the additional fourth axis allows for mm -hmm. multi-face machining, uh, significantly reducing the number of operations. I especially like with the fourth axis, when I'm milling and the rotary table is rotating, that I can produce complex shapes. Yeah, it's great, isn't it? And Kitagawa have excelled here too. Providing rotary tables with good lead cutting capabilities, delivering a high rotating torque achieved by a large worm wheel with high teeth. And let me guess, Hamish, allow me to produce parts stronger and faster. Strong. Let me stop you there. But yes, it'll allow you to increase feed rates and cut deeper on your workpiece. Such a killjoy, Hamish. <laughs> anyway, you mentioned that there are three major improvements, the MK series. Clamping torque, and what are the other two? Yes, you'll notice these recessed mounting bolt pockets into the actual casting of the MK series. This makes it much easier for mounting onto a machine bed or onto a riser plate. So why is that important, Hamish? As we know, during production, metal chips build up and can cause problems with the efficiency and speed of production. With these additional pockets, the areas where the chips build up is reduced and they are also easier to clean away. So less areas to clean out. And this design also allows for wider trunnion designs to be utilised, uh, maximising your work holding options. I was going to ask, as a work holding company, you must have many options for these rotary tables. We often leave this decision down to the customer, as they often have the work holding to suit their workpiece already. But here at Kitagawa, we have many different options available, a few of which we have here today, including a zero point system, a swift clamp, and a three jaw open centre chuck. The advantage of using Kitagawa is that we can guarantee the uh, accuracy of your work holding solution. Uh, we can also supply you with spares to keep production going. I hadn't really considered that, but I'm definitely going to rest easy knowing that the support is out there. Um, so tell me more about some of these work holding options. That brings me nicely on to the final improvement of the MK series. We now offer a much wider range of rotary joints similar to the one we have here today and the one installed on this MK series here. With the MK200, we now offer a six port version which includes a 12.5 millimeter diameter through port for passing through additional air or hydraulic services. 
This through port can also be used as a wiring duct for seating confirmation sensors, enabling you to automate work holding and further expand your work holding capabilities. There is even a range of high pressure rotary joints that will enable you to attach smaller and faster actuating components to your rotary table. Okay, so I want to get an MK series rotary table. What do you need to know from me? We need to know what machine you have and its control system. We also need to know if the machine has fourth axis preparation, so with cables, drives, software to control the rotary table. Mm -hmm. So what happens if I don't have fourth axis prep? Very simple. You can contact your machine supplier to see if they can provide it. Okay. Or we have the, uh, its very own independent control system called the Quinte controller. Wow, you've thought of everything. But how does this control system work with my machine? Do I simply need to get my timing right? No, not at all. The Quinte controller can be connected to the machine's M code and safety circuits. Mm -hmm. Programs can be saved and created on the Quinte controller. There's also a, a remote control option where you can use the machine's CNC control system to operate the rotary table. You guys have thought of everything. Thank you so much for the introduction. So to sum up, the MK series has higher clamping torque, improved mounting via these bolt pockets and lots more rotary joint options enabling you or me to attach automated work holdings to the rotary table. I couldn't have said it better myself. And if you want to find out any more information about the MK series, visit our Kitagawa Europe website and our LinkedIn page for latest news and information. Um, and we hope to see you again soon.